Agra has proposed to acquire the shares of Rosenthal after it emerged that the owner was due to retire. Agra representatives say the merger will lead to improved and better services, which will include giving customers the chance to order firearms at any Agra branch and have the product delivered there. Um, the synergies that we, that we see is from a, from a back office point of view and from a pricing point of view, that the pricing that we can import in uh, bigger scales, um, that the pricing actually will reduce and will benefit um, the end customer. Agri representatives also pointed out that the sales of firearms will still take place after a gun license has been granted by the Namibian police. This will ensure that firearms can only be bought by individuals who have licenses that allow them to buy firearms. Nobody can walk into a shop and, and just select a firearm and will be given it immediately. He, uh, it will be put aside, you will get the numbers and you will apply for a permit from, from NAMPO and once that has been granted, the license has been granted, then the actual sale can take place. And that obviously will continue as is. So I think it would be far-fetched to say that um, through this proposed merger there would be increased trading uh, or demand for firearms. I think that is unsubstantiated. The merger will allow Agra to import products in bulk in order to reduce the sales prices. Aaron Mushaukwa for the news on one.